Mockernut hickory. The scientific name is pronounced Caria alba. It's a member of the Juglandaceae family, which is the walnut family. And this is one of your more common hickories that you'll find in the woods. Um, it's got alternate compound leaves with seven to nine leaflets. And the, one of the key identifying um, characteristics of mockernut hickory is the pubescence or kind of silky hairs on the underside of the leaf and on the rachis or the stem of the leaf. Uh, you'll also notice some lenticels or uh, little hole-like structures on the, on the twigs. But the pub pubescence on the underside of the leaf and on the rachis is key. Um, Mockernut hickory also has a very large terminal bud, uh, up to uh, two centimeters. And again, it has also kind of uh, got a silky, fuzzy look to it. The nuts of mockernut hickory uh, have a very thick husk with four definite deep sutures. Uh, it does have a sweet kernel if you're so inclined to, uh, to give it a taste, which matures in the fall. Uh, and you usually find a lot of the, the seeds or nuts under, uh, under the hickory tree, so they're pretty prolific when they do fall. And the leaf scar for winter identification uh, is heart-shaped, which is a distinguishing characteristic. Um, like I said before, it is the most abundant of the hickories and is found on drier soils of ridges and hillsides in the north, um, sometimes on uh, moist woodlands and alluvial bottoms. But there you see the range of Caria alba mockernut hickory.